no death. He's got many faces. I look forward to seeing this one. Favorite death of the series? Oh. It's difficult. Sean's was amazing because it was just so shocking because no one knew that they were going to kill off the main characters. But my favorite death is probably uh, Oberyn Martell's, the, the skull crushing. That was pretty spectacular. When um, Oberyn Martell got his head squished, loved that scene. So sad though, because I miss Pedro. I think he's coming tonight. No, I don't think he is. Maybe. Maybe. If he is, I'll be like, ah! <laughs> Prince Oberyn's. Uh, that was so, so shocking. Not, not only in terms of, of the brutality of it, but in terms of the fact that I really didn't see it coming. I hadn't read the script for that episode. Um, and it was one of those classic Game of Thrones moments where you think, oh, the underdog's winning. The oh, no, no, he's had his head squished. Um, Charles dance on the toilet. Thank you. <laughs> Stop watching it, man. That's, that's, that, that's scary. Was that as emotional for you? <laughs> it was. And I definitely cried the first time I watched it. It's very different watching it back than it is doing it at the time. Um, yeah, I still get teary when I watch it sometimes, although I don't watch it very often. I do, but I mean, it's, it's weird to watch yourself, you know. I, I, I like to watch people's reactions better. I mean, I watched a lot of people's reactions at Hodor dying, and that really actually moved me. Uh, I think there were two. The first was Sean Bean, uh, Ned Stark, because even while we were filming it, I kept thinking, oh, someone will save him. And then the second one was Hodor. I never saw that coming either. I was like, what? Uh, favorite deaths, Hodor. I mean, that's not just a favorite death, but probably my favorite scene in the entire uh, series so far. Just the way it was put together, you know, intercutting his death with, you know, the scenes of, of him as a child. Very emotional, hard-hitting, devastating. Um, and Ned Stark, same reason. Hard-hitting, but, you know, extremely heartbreaking. Um, so I like seeing good guys die, I guess. My little girl, Shireen. That was heartbreaking. I cried when I read that in my little room at home when I had the, the pages open. I went, I, 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 I hoped that it was a joke. Um, a horrible thing to happen, but incredibly dramatic uh, in, in, as regards our storytelling. Um, I think probably Joffrey's, you know, those eyes, you know, the strangulation, the going red. It was such a, I thought it was a, such a brilliantly acted death. And uh, it was a surprise, um, like all good Thrones deaths are, just the way it manifested itself. It had captured everything that's great about Thrones, I think. I like the way Ramsay died. He got eaten by his own dogs. That's a very Scandinavian death. I like that.